A new man passing by. Life is good. Best I've ever felt. Hi, friends. Welcome to our morning of let's stall and find projects we actually don't want to do in order to not go walking and hiking quite yet. But really what we're trying to do is we're trying to wait for the sunshine to peek out. Yeah. Oh wait, let's see, go higher. Right there. There's no sunshine out there yet, but it is coming. Both of us want a little, it's cold out there right now. Can you not do that? That one's trash. Why is it trash? Because it's cracked. Okay. So we're trying to gather things that we could possibly go do in the car. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna go help him. We're trying to gather things to do in the car, maybe on our way, maybe split up. Um, I've got my little list going for us for the day. Um, we're just kind of stalling, trying to get the sun out. One of my to-do things is to go through. Here, let's do a before. Let's do a before, you're in the way. Hang on. I already took some down. Um, all over the Tupperware. Let's just take it all down. Well, why don't we go through and specifically take down the stuff we think we're gonna give to her, then we can organize this. Up. That doesn't make sense. Obvious. Because it does make sense. Because you can obviously see that like, yeah, but I don't know what's in here. I, I don't know what has lids. Wow. I don't know. His way of doing it is not my way. Can you just take it all down? And then we match everything up, make sure we have lids. And then we divide up what we want to give Kaylee for college and what we don't. This is, this is why I like to do organization stuff alone sometimes. Because our methods are not the same. We usually get to the same point at the end. But we are going to work together. <laughs> I'm just getting it down. <laughs> I know. I'll go and organize lids too. We just have, it's it's literally overflowing. You've seen me open this cupboard before and things just fall out. So we're gonna start with this. Also, to start our morning. The peonies are all in full bloom. They're super pretty. Here is the messy before. He is wiping the shelves down. Yeah, it's like only the top two are supposed to be got like, residue on it. It's probably just water. Yeah, but uh, we've been putting more storage tubs on this shelf, which they don't belong here. So, all right, let's put like half of them back in. Okay, <laughs> no, these are the ones that Kaylee is going to take with her. They're talking. I'll go find the mess. Um, I am not decided yet. I think I'm going to donate that one. I don't need it. So I think I'm going to donate all these guys. It's we got the lunch boxes from Costco when we used to get them for free, and <laughs> we they didn't. Work good. They weren't great. Um, they just were done with our lunch box era. See what I did there? <laughs> Trying to relate it to Taylor Swift. Yes. Nice. Now that Ashley's going to middle school, she's not going to take a box lunch. She's not going to take a sack lunch anymore. She'll pack granola bars and power bars in her backpack, just like all my other kids do. So we're left with these little, you know, cheapy ones, which is totally fine with me. I might do like a, a, a tub of lids, but for right now it looks good on the shelf like this. What you need? All right, before Jason comes down here, I'm getting, I'm gonna replace what I just gave Kaylee. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Costco to replace something like this. But we'll, we'll, we'll ease into that. But for now, I have so much room in my cupboard that I can finally, well see here's the problem with my super narrow cupboards, is that they don't fit things like this. So I don't even know if this is gonna fit on the shelf that I just made room for. We'll see here. I wanna show you what it looks like as of right now. We donated a whole bunch. I don't need them. A lot of them are like the ones that your ham comes in when you buy ham at the store. Um, and just mismatched ones and I'm just, I'm done with it. So this is what's left. These are like meal prep ones up here. Uh, they're just odd shaped rectangle ones up there. I will use them and I'm, I might bring them down here because we will use those more often. But I wanted to see if I'm using these ones more um, just because they have really good lids and it looks better for like I'm taking something somewhere. Okay, it won't fit there. But my problem is, if it fits there, fine, but will it shut? Oh, good. 
because these are so narrow. All right, well, that's it. And I know I have this bowl. I just don't know where, and it's dirty. So I don't know where the bowl is, but I know I like that one. And this guy, I think Kaylee just didn't take it. So I'll donate that. And these are all the throwaway that didn't have a match or actually I still have, I don't know why this one's here. I have all these guys. These ones are all up there. No? Yeah, they are. We also have storage bin tubs like this with slime in them. <laughs> so this does match a set that I still have, um, but it has slime. So easy little project all organized. Now when Kaylee unloads, it's easy to put all the Tupperware back and it doesn't all fall out and you don't just shove it in. All right, just did my walk. I did four miles. Um, three fourths of that were in the cold. <laughs> the sun did not come out an hour and a half ago like it was supposed to. So it's almost one o'clock now. Um, I was able to do part of it, maybe about a mile of it, talking to my aunt. Um, she called this morning asking me about a few things, so that was fun to talk to her and get caught up. And, um, usually I get to see her every summer, but we're not going down there, so kind of a bummer, but anyway, feels good. I'm, I'm tired, and my knees were kind of a little bit achy, but I got my little activity goal move my move goal for the day which is good I wouldn't put it past any of my friends for if they asked me to go walking again today I would probably say yes so I might text them um, but it's if I get the rest of our stuff done today and I have energy still <laughs> so um, I'm gonna Jason's not done yet that water bottle. I'm going to move that water bottle. I hate things moving around in cars. Um, he's not done with his hike yet, but we need to go to Lowe's together. So, and I don't know if he's going to want to go to Lowe's all sweaty from his hike. I'm going to move that. So I'm going to actually try and call him really quick, see if he has reception and uh, go from there. Because I, I would rather not go home and change and do anything else because we're just gonna work out in the yard. Um, lay down some gravel. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go and pick those things up. We have to lay down gravel and maybe some mulch and clean the patio off. And I am, like, I'm not gonna shower <laughs> until I get all that stuff done. So I need to get a hold of him to see if he is almost back to his car. He's still parked to go on this hike. So I know he's not done yet, so. Okay, Jason's upstairs showering. We're both home. And we're gonna come out here. We're gonna start to move some of this stuff. See if I can prop you on here while I move the table. I need to get the rug. We're gonna probably do the same scenario where we put this stuff over here and move the couch off. Let's just put this rug inside so it doesn't necessarily get wet. So we likely, I don't know, I don't know what we're gonna do. Maybe we just move the furniture and stack this one on top of it over to that side and just kind of rush everything, you know. We have to hose this off, scrub it down. Um, that's not gonna chink up my paint at all, is it? But over here, um, we're gonna go to Lowe's right now. We're gonna get some gravel, and we're gonna put, when we come back, we're gonna put that stone back here, that one up there where that chair is. Um, even if the chair stays there, we'll put the, the rock or the stone underneath it. And we're gonna make a little gravel path Regardless of the, that staying here, <laughs> um, it would be nice to have a little gravel path going through here so you're not stepping in dirt. And then I might actually add gravel like coming out here 
so that it's matching what we have out front. Out, I can't go out this way because we've got the, uh, well maybe I can. We have our gr grill right here. I haven't really decided if we're gonna keep it or not. Um, but we have the gravel between the rocks and the stones over here in the front that we drive on with the car. And it's worked out well in so far. I actually am curious about getting that, like the rock glue and you spray it on pebbles and it keeps it in place. It would be nice to do that out there too. I don't think Jason's there yet. <laughs> so we'll just take it as it comes. But if we can clean the patio up, have her not come on the patio anymore, her being Dot, um, I think we can have a lot of improvement for cleanliness out here um, and make it so that I want to come back out here because it would be nice to like bring a book out, hang out with our friends. Like we came, they, our friends came back over here after we went to dinner Saturday night and we stayed inside, but it would have been, it had it been a little bit nicer weather and uh, not so late, we could have like, you can't even see, we have our little lights strung up here still and the lights on the umbrella light up. And so we could have had a really nice atmosphere out here, but, and we're getting better weather. So we're gonna re-clean all of this yet again. <laughs> but Kaylee doesn't work for a couple hours. So I'm hoping she understands that she is going to help us. All right, we are heading to Lowe's. Just pulled over into the parking lot. <laughs> because there's like these really funky looking clouds up in the sky. I don't even know if it's gonna pick up on camera. There's these cool clouds and they're really wispy clouds, but there's a rainbow going through them and it is the coolest thing ever. So I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. It's right above the trees there. I don't know if you're gonna see it. It's so cool because the rainbow is just going right through those clouds. Okay, we're at Lowe's and Jason's inside buying toilet parts for the store and I'm gonna get some of this river rock this is what we got for the driveway area but I need to have them come and open it up we'll bring our car through that's what you do you I'm gonna take a picture of that buy it and then we'll come through with our car um, and get that I want this plant so bad it's only 32 but I need to go see if I have a good pot for it. I think I do. I think I'm gonna take my hydrangea out. I'm gonna pluck that for them. I think I want this. But I don't think I'll get it today. Should I get that color? That's the color of mine. Down there, but I love this color. So, I'd also love two little palm trees to line my sidewalk out front. Wouldn't that be so cute? Jacob says he has these little palm trees at his house in their backyard. They'd be so cute. But alas, we're just getting rock. Okay, got our river rock. We already know it looks yeah. good. Thank you. Yep, have a good day. All right, came to Costco because it's right across the street from Lowe's and we just, I had the turkey sandwich, a little turkey provolone. I'm gonna get all the parts for this to make it home because it was really good. I just need to know what this sauce is that they put on it because that was really good. Where I can do like a penne or no, what is it called? Uh, bruschetta? No, well, and I can get the bread from here too. But we're just wrapping up because I, I didn't finish it. So Jason's going to take that for lunch tomorrow. Yeah. He had a slice of pizza and some ice cream, so I think someone made a better choice. Me? No. <laughs> You, you ate a yummier one, but not the healthier one. Uh, yeah. We ran into Costco to see if they had the new little gummy, the mixed bag of gummy snacks. They didn't have it, but they do have a new flavor of poppy and it was on rebate. So, so you have to get it. So I have to get them. It's a dollar a can when it was on rebate. And they have the new lemon lime scent or flavor. Raspberry rose, which I've had, and a new watermelon. I've never tasted the watermelon one. So, the kids are gonna be excited about that. What are we doing, hon? Taking our aggression from each other off on the yard. <laughs> Just 
insane. <laughs> well, we have put in a little gravel. Good idea. And she got the right amount of bags. Say that again. She was right. She was right. I got four bags when he wasn't four around bags. me. And then as soon as I was by him getting the four bags, he's like, oh, four bags. You don't need four bags. Turns out four bags isn't enough. Yeah, we could use I would one like more. To some more down and around her, so that, that it's a full path to step on gravel and not dirt. Yeah. Because I'm sick of the dirt and the poop, which is what we're going to work on next. Yep. Next is to move all this again. And we got to rewash it. Okay. We have cleaned off the rug, moved the couch back on. Now we're kind of de-dirtying the sides here and it's then we're gonna fine. I know it's not how I had it but we're gonna hose it all off and then call it good and um, I am going to wipe down just the top surface of the cushions it's gonna rain tomorrow which will help get the last of the soap out of the rug but I'm gonna spray this guy down because the birds Loved sitting on top of this. I know, they did. It's fine. I'm just cleaning it. Don't say birds too loud. Yes. That's Chelsea's shirt she just gave you. We put a few more in your closet too. So. I think it looks pretty good. Ashley got to see our little... What did you think of our little path, Ashley? I thought it was going to be a little different. What do you think? Well, it's not fancy. What do you think we were going to do? She's eating her bugs. I know. She has her bug ball. All right. Last step before going in. It's not perfect. I think the rug has been tearing up the paint right here. Put the rug back. There. Oh, All done. Plants. Put my plant out there. I think it would be, it would look really good if there was a little hibiscus flower out here I think that would look really good will they survive yeah I think so okay we are all done and we are ready to call it quits for the day <laughs> and it's only 4 30. I should oh someone's uh, gonna be Ashley's friends nope it's a spam call came shopping with uh, my hair I'm getting it cut tomorrow so just ignore that but we came shopping for these. Abby came down here earlier today and these guys have made it into the 75% off bucket. So they're only $4. So I'm getting two body washes and a lotion. I knew they would go down eventually. And then we're getting a whipped coconut milkshake soap for the downstairs bathroom. Okay, we also went to Trader Joe's. That's what started this whole thing is Jason wanted some gummy thingies. But I tried this Enchanted Jangle. Um, it has a good little assortment. Probably gonna actually save that one for game night because it would be a good one for game night. But we needed granola, but, so I tried this peanut butter protein granola. Dude, I'm eating this. Abby, where's the little chocolate? Peanut butter cups. Yeah, the peanut butter cups. Let me see them. I've been eating them um, like with one little chocolate, you know, like Reese's cup, the mini ones, and then like a piece of this granola, and it tastes so good. But it's peanut butter. And anyway, it's a nice little snack. But then we also got these gummies for Ashley. Don't tell her that I have five of them right here. But they're like summer vibes gummies. And they, oh, see that's why I wanted to do this outside when it was more lit up. Um, but they are, let me see if you can see them. They're a little like summer shapes. So there's a starfish, a seashell, a crab. Light up and, your phone. Light up on your phone. Oh, that will help. Yeah, there we go. Um, and that a little uh, palm tree and what's the last one? Oh, a pair of sunglasses. Isn't that so cute? Um, so anyway, there they are with that lit, lit up. All right, so <laughs> everywhere we went, we didn't ha take a bag with us. Um, we're like, no, no, we have recycled bags in the car, but now we have too much stuff. <laughs> and I remembered I have a recycle bag just right here that I've met put in my car. Here, you want to put him in there? Okay. okay. <laughs> he holds his snacks. Okay, Abby, load them in. We're going to sign off with you guys. Um, we're going to go make some orange chicken. Sorry, bless you, Abby. 
Well, and some garlic pasta for Abby. I have some corn on the cob that I made last night that I'll warm up. Is that everything? Um, and yeah, yeah, I'll get my stuff out of the front. But uh, we're gonna sign off with you guys because we are beat. Um, here, Abby, will you take that? Okay. All right, we're gonna see you guys later. Night.